Hello everyone! Here we are at Naramata Creek. We're going for a hike today uh, up to see Naramata Falls. It's supposed to be just a, a quick little hike, hour or something, up to the falls and check things out. Uh, Dana's run out of mines to take me hiking to, so now we're just going up neat creeks. Uh, so we're going to go for a walk up here and show you guys what the falls look like. Nice little parking area down at the bottom. You, you turn in right at the left turn down to Naramata. It's right across the, the main road. Little gravel road that leads up to the parking area. And then uh, walk up to the falls. I think if you continue walking past the falls, I'm not sure if the trail actually takes you there, but it takes up right up close to the KVR Railway Trans Canada Trail. So we'll have a look and see if you can actually get through up to that. Well, we'll show you more along the way. Well, right at the head of the trail, there's an outhouse here. The trail leads off. You can hear the creek just off in the background here. Oh, looks like we cross it right away on the bridge. It is not a very big creek. And according to the one right up we read, uh, you may have to actually walk through the creek here. Up towards the falls. They said prepare to get your feet wet, so it's not that big of a creek. Beautiful looking area. Oh no, dead rock. Hiking up along the river here. It's a beautiful trail, easy to walk on. It's not very steep at all. And there are benches along the way. Say hi, Alex. Benches along the way where you can sit and enjoy the sound of the babbling brook. We are kind of in spring runoff, so it's a little bit more than just a little bit of babble right now, but still just a small little creek. So, the path crosses the creek many times over, there's bridges all around. This path goes to a great big rock. Bridge crosses the creek, great big rock, there's the kids. Hey boys, wave for the camera! Great little trail, so far. Great little trail, beautiful river. So far, we're having a great trip. Once you get out of the park, park proper, some of the creek crossings get a little more precarious. So far, we haven't had to get our feet wet. I'll film Alex crossing so I can actually catch him falling in the water on film. Aw, oh, he made it. How boring. Look at those rocks, my goodness, they're huge. Another dubious creek crossing. Before this day out, well, someone's gonna have a wet foot. Looks like they're in the process of building a bridge or something here. I better put the camera away and go help. <laughs> wow, this hike uh, gets uh, interesting. Look up, look way up. Look way, way, way up. Look at those overhanging rocks. Let's hope there's no uh, earthquake right about now. Yikes. It looks like the hike is approaching the waterfall. I can see it way, way, way up through the trees there. Let's go see if we can find a better view. Oh yeah, there it is. The 
try to get underneath it to get a better shot of this. Here we are at the fold. Very undescript path, eh? <laughs> it goes every which way. Let's start off with the water just running over the rocks and pan our way up. Cascading over broken rocks. Vertically falling off ledges. And the big falls up above. One, two, three big falls all in this one spot. Beautiful. Lunchtime on the creek. Oh, the camera. Smile. I have too busy eating. And here we are finishing off the hike. Back to the cars and the outhouse. Nice little hike. I'd say it's a, eh, a short hour's walk up to the waterfalls. Fairly easy, only a couple of tricky sections. And beautiful country. Great way to spend this late spring morning. Well guys, I'm sure Dana will uh, take me, drag me along another uh, hike here in the near future. So I will do another video on another hike sometime shortly.